We're to the board member comments. Board member Reby. I would just like to say what a great year I've had. I've visited some of my schools. I've been to lots of board meetings. I've been to town council meetings, city council meetings. Uh, last night I went to the swearing in of our new city council mayor, uh, city mayor, and um, it was really exciting to see the relationship between our local board and our city and then joining the fold as a state board member. I think our strong communities build strong schools. My goal this year is to visit every one of my schools in my district. Um, as for uh, student voices, I have the great opportunity to be with student voices every day when I am in my schools. And um, we have a lot of students that are struggling. And so I, I really encourage us to all go out and visit students that are not in our household or in our neighborhoods because I do have a very fortunate situation where I can see a wide demographic of students and there are a lot of things going on and as uh, those students from East spoke about every kid has a, a, a cross to bear and whether it's small or big we should be empathetic to all the different struggles that our kids have so uh, thanks for the opportunity to serve with you guys. Um, thank you, Board Member Hanson. Last night I got to go to a new school opening. It was really fun. It was an elementary school, and they've taken two. This is in Tula School District, a Sterling Elementary. They've taken two elementary schools and made them one. So they did that over Christmas break, if you can imagine. And I went last night. It was a super fun experience, and I was excited to see how excited the teachers were and you know, I thought oh after all that moving and everything they're gonna be worn out but they were so excited to be there and so it was a lot of fun I was glad I could go Kim. Board member right um, I there's a program called watchdogs in our public schools that's specifically focused on dads getting into our schools it's really cool and they kind of tricked me into coming to have donuts with my daughter my daughter tricked me and they sold me on it and I signed up for a whole day. So I took a whole day off work uh, in December and I was a watchdog at Cedar Ridge Elementary. And I loved it, it was so fun. I got to mediate several scuffles on the playground. <laughs> I got to pick up five different coats left on the playground afterwards, just made me so sad. I mean, cause kids just lose their coats and hopefully they find them. I got help in kindergarten. I got help in my daughter's class with some math and tutor some kids one-on-one. -on -one. Extraordinary experience. And it's sad that, that so few dads get this program. So this program is focused on dads. Sorry ladies, but you are not allowed in this program are really trying to get men into our public schools. So I had to encourage, you know, if you know any men, you know, to really encourage them to try that program. They used my time really well. I felt it was great. And so it's a really awesome program happening. Sorry, I just really thought it was cool. Okay. Thank you. Any other comments? Well, thank you for today. I, I think we have one one more action item and, and that's... Uh, Motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. We have a second. Any discussion on this motion? I don't think we're going to have any. Um, all in favor say aye. Those opposed? Voting was unanimous. We'll see you tomorrow, bright and early.